Tonight, it's about saving this town. After that levee breach, water now is only hours away from I-29 and Hamburg, Iowa. Hundreds flee, afraid that these temporary levees being built behind me just won't hold. Water is now where it's not supposed to be. A trickle here, brought on by gushing here. You think where we're standing right now is going to be underwater? Yeah, a lot of water. The Missouri River bursts through dirt and grass, tearing a hole in the levee bigger than a football field. Where there's water, there's few people moving out after the first warning. Two weeks now. And had it about two weeks ago. It's been a process, everyone pitching in to help the neighbors. It's been emotionally draining for friends that are out on the bottom, and it's, it's just devastating to have to move out of your house on the bottom. For some, it's not just leaving a building behind, but a means to survive. I'm without a home, living with my kids, all my stuff's in a semi. No job where I work, they closed up. The levee, now wide open, brings with it liquid heartache and pain. An inevitable flood bears down on people who planned for this, but feel unprepared. Take it one day at a time, and I don't know from there. And wonderfully tonight, a surprise arrival of some much needed reinforcements here at the front with the, the rising river. The Army uh, uh, National Guard out of Burlington, Iowa. 50 soldiers with the 831st Engineering Division arrived here on site with some heavy equipment to try to help out the cause holding back this, uh, this river tonight. Again, these 50 soldiers are here not only to, to help build though too, but monitor the situation with the breached levee. Uh, we're also told that they're working on an effort too to actually punch, believe it or not, another hole downstream in the levee to let some of that water that's rushing in rush back out so it might not get as deep here uh, where we're standing right now. But again, the area we're in, they're still trying to raise this levee another nine feet, hoping that their effort pays off and keeps the town of Hamburg, Iowa dry. We're live in Hamburg, Dave Roberts, KMTV, Action 3 News.